Hi friend, uh, today uh, the topic is going to be like how to find peace in this troubled world. So, um, if you look at, uh, if you observe, if you have made a genuine observation with this world nowadays, you can see that people are uh, have lost their mental peace. They go on complaining about their uh, misfortunes and their uh, unlucky life. What we can understand uh, from this, like uh, in spite of this booming uh, scientific advancement and amazing developments, people, modern man is terribly troubled with the stress. They are ter terribly troubled with their problems and difficulties. A modern man is tormented with the existential crisis uh, characterized by the meaningless, hopelessness, restlessness, worthlessness and helplessness. In spite of the amazing affluence, the modern man is afflicted with a spiritual vacuum that he is experiencing the meaningless in his life, like what he has to do the next point. He is actually clue, clueless. So stress has become the most brutal killer and the threatening villain which affects both physically and mentally. So people will uh, who is gone with he who is afflicted with the stress they will find in different type of uh, self annihilating strategies. And this is something which is extremely unfulfilling. So, let me tell you what are those self annihilating strategies. So, the self annihilating strategies are like uh, alcoholism and sexual perversions and uh, smoking and suicide. So, these are all these strategies the modern man find to escape from all those type of the brutal stress they are affecting. So if you uh, take an example of uh, alcoholism, so what actually happens? People will just find a solace in that alcohol. And they will think that they will, it will make you better. But in reality, alcohol can only damage your uh, cells of the body. And if you take uh, of uh, some type of addiction like uh, drug addiction, so people will just find solace like in some brain altering drugs. So these drugs cannot give you the peace. It can only just uh, make your uh, brain cells and immune system weaken. So this won't make you feel good but it will make you harm. And also, uh, if you talk about the suicide case, uh, a psychologist are of the opinion that suicide incidents, the incidence of suicide has become an alarming rate. So these type of self-annihilating strategies, how to overcome that? 
no more anguish just feel the grace of god and receive an abundance never miss the wonderful opportunities that come along in your way by deviating by finding out different type of these type of self defeating strategies it won't help you so just be aware with your uh, spiritual values and embrace that divine values the divine peace so in this gospel jesus christ speaks about a divine peace there is a divine peace that is superseding all human understanding and which transcends all type of physical scales it is beyond the limits of it's beyond the space and time so that is the actual divine peace that would be an infinite divine peace so you have to look after that divine peace in this gospel uh, jesus christ speaks about this uh, divine peace the holy bible uh, depicts three types of uh, peace the first one is spiritual peace the spiritual peace uh, that is the peace with uh, the god and second one is relational peace that is peace with other people and at the third one is uh, that is like emotional peace that is the peace within within ourselves that is inside your bottom of heart and there is this uh, famous uh, psychologist uh, his name is dr c g jung and uh, he has uh, depicted this predicament of this uh, meaningless wandering of people like he has depicted uh, that uh, meaninglessness of the life in his uh, book like modern man in search of soul so that is the actual book uh, and uh, i recommend you uh, to read that book this is actually an insightful book so the modern man is affected with uh, different type of hard situations so we know that we are in lot of confusions so what is the ultimate solution for this that's why i'm coming to that point that the solution is actually when you connected to the god when you strictly adhere to the spiritual values you try to receive the abundance the abundance where it come from it come from the grace of god so let me tell you uh, one perfect thing like we are a just a human with our limitations so we are the humans with the finite mind so when we people when we the finite mind when it is connected to the infinite power of the ultimate consciousness you will be getting that divine grace divine peace so try to connect with the higher consciousness and embrace that abundance 
your all insecurities and uh, your all kind of frustrations and everything will wither away instantaneously so what i want to tell you today is that uh, do not be dismayed when you get uh, confusions in your mind you don't have to run madly with a different type of self defeating or different type of perversions or other like addictive behaviors you have to rely on the spiritual matters that matters the most you will have to follow the spiritual guidance in john chapter 14 27 jesus said peace i leave with you my peace i give you i do not give to you as the world gives do not let your hearts be troubled and do not be afraid